Today we're going to show you an easy solution for creating ADA compliance signage. To get started, all you need is a computer, a Roland EGX engraver, an automatic or manual raster pen tool, engraving software, and ADA signage substrates. As of 2012, new regulations dictate that all new construction and building alterations comply with the standards of the American with Disabilities Act. This directive affects thousands of venues nationwide, everything from hotels, restaurants, and hospitals, to schools, offices, apartments, and more. There has never been a better time to turn the growing ADA signage market into a substantial profit center for your sign or engraving business. The EGX is the perfect solution for a full spectrum of ADA signage, including color-filled signs with inlaid graphics and informational signs for fire exits and building layout diagrams. You may choose from a range of professional ADA compliant software, including Popular Engrave Lab and Flexi Engrave. Both have all the tools you need to create all types of ADA signage, and both are excellent solutions for working with vector images and generating braille. Once you've installed your software and connected your EGX engraver to the computer, you're ready to begin working. The entire production process can be completed in minutes. First, import your design file into Engrave Lab or Flexi Engrave. To create the Braille, enter your text and convert it to Grade 2 Braille. The software makes it simple. After confirming the layout, you can review the engraving parameters for the pictogram and text and for the braille engraving. Once everything looks correct, you're ready to output the sign. ADA signage is a two-material process that requires both an ADA-compliant single-layer substrate and a tactile material. Begin by loading the substrate. Next, use the control panel to move the carriage into position. It should be located to the lower left corner of the material. Engraving depth is controlled by using the Auto Z control. You will begin by adjusting the nose cone to the proper depth for the two cutters you will be using. Dial the nose cone to 33 thousandths of an inch and insert the character cutter until it touches the jig plate. Then adjust the nose cone to 42 thousandths of an inch and insert the braille drill cutter until it touches the jig. After you make these adjustments, you'll now be able to swap tools back and forth on all signs. Now you can begin engraving the braille portion of the sign using the braille drill cutter. Next, place the adhesive back tactile material into position on the substrate. Once again, move the carriage into position. When this is completed, replace the braille drill cutter with the character cutter. Output the file and the EGX will automatically route the text and pictogram. To create the raised braille text, you'll insert specially sized plastic beads called rasters into the holes you've just engraved. There are two methods of inserting these rasters. For the EGX 400 and 600, use the auto raster insert. For devices without the auto raster insert, we recommend using the raster pen tool from Accent Signage Systems. Remove the excess material. That's it! Your ADA signage is finished in minutes. Here's an example of your potential return on investment. Thanks for joining